Imagine if your 13 year old son's photo was stolen and then used in a fake Facebook profile. That's exactly what happened to one mid-state woman and now she's speaking out. News Channel 5's Kimberly Davis explains why Facebook says there's nothing they can do about it. You rely on social media to have, you know, their standards up to par to um, protect our children. But apparently um, their standards are not where they need to be. The mid-state mother who requested to remain anonymous tells us she learned that lesson the hard way after reporting a fake Facebook account that used her husband's and 13-year-old son's identity. It was my little boy as the cover photo and my husband and my little boy as the profile picture. The Facebook account manager used a fake name, saying that he was a widower living in Flint, Michigan. The mother says only one word can describe just how she's feeling. Violated and a violation to the core. But when her husband reported the fake account, Facebook sent back this message reading in part, in this case, we reviewed the profile you reported and found that it doesn't go against our community standards. A message the mid-state mother was surprised to read. It really, it, I had to read it twice because I was thinking, surely this is not what I'm reading. The family's friends were able to bombard the fake account, which caused the user to delete the fake profile. The mother says she will be beefing up her privacy settings and hopes her story can possibly protect another child's identity. If this has happened to my child, this is happening to other children out there and parents need to be aware. Kimberly Davis, News Channel 5. And the mother also tells us she and her husband decided to delete their son's Facebook account for extra precaution.